What's up everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Emerald. So, last time we finally found some civilization. Something's happening and I don't like it. I've seen shady characters wandering in and out of Professor Cosmo's home. Oh, uh, very intriguing, what's he up to? See, take a look, this is my precious Azuril. It's slick and smooth and plushy too. Oh, it's alive, I thought it was a doll. Move Tutor's house, ooh, Move Tutor. Let's pay him a visit, shall we? We need the move deleter, really. What up, Tubbs? I'm the move tutor. No. I know all the moves that Pokemon learn, every one of them, and I can teach Pokemon those moves. I can teach a move to a Pokemon of yours if you'd like. I'll do it for a heart scale. Aw, oh, I don't think we have any, do we? If Pokemon need to learn a move, come back with the heart scale. Pretty sure we haven't got one. Right. Any secrets? Damn it. I was hoping there'd be things buried in the farms. Fossil Maniac's house. Ooh, interesting. Let's talk to the fisherman. I like to fish, but I also like to battle. If anyone challenges me, I'm there even if I'm fishing. Oh, okay. Wasn't really expecting a battle in the middle of town, but hey, it's your funeral, buddy. Fisherman Nolan. And he has a barboach. Captain Barbosa. You'd best start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner. You're in one. Oh, and that reminds me. We still haven't evolved Kadabra. However, I did try. Um, I'm still going to keep trying, but... It's way more complicated than I was led to believe. I was told just log on with two different accounts on the emulator, trade with yourself. Turns out it's not that simple, and if it is, I can't seem to get it working, because every time I try, I get told the wireless club isn't connected, so I'm going to keep trying, but yeah, I don't know. My big brother's the fossil maniac. He's a nice guy who loves fossils. He loves digging holes, too. He dug this hole by himself. You can have this, you can dig holes, just like my big brother. And we get TM28, dig. I remember that very well. That TM is as old school as they come. I remember that very, very well. Nope, nope, other direction. There we are. Dig. Let's see who can learn it. Combuscan, Sableye, and Aron. We will probably teach it to Aron, but we need to get rid of Cut first. So for now, we will hold on to it. Right, what's going on over here then? Why is there a quarry in the back of this dude's house? Kind of weird. What up, yo? I'm the Fossil Maniac. I'm a nice guy who loves fossils. Yes, I was told. Do you want a fossil? Yes, I do, but the fossils around these parts all belong to me. None for you. Aw, dick. If you can't bear to go without a fossil, look in the desert where there are boulders and sand that may hide fossils. Interesting. Aw, oh, come on. There must be secrets in here. Let's try going down a bit. I don't believe there's none in here. Apparently there's none in here. Well, that's bullshit. That's like the perfect place to hide things. Okay, are we done with the town now? I think we are. No, actually, I think there might be one house we're missing. Yes, this one. Random crater! Let's see who resides within, shall we? If I can ever make it through the door. What up? Professor Cosmo went off to Meteor Falls on Route 114 with some people from Team Magma. Ooh. What is he up to? Have you already challenged Flannery, the leader of Lava Ridge Gym? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. The girl's grandfather was famous. He was one of the Elite Four in the Pokemon League at one point. Ooh. It wouldn't surprise me to see Flannery become a great trainer in her own right. Interesting. Right, let's buy some shit, because we really need some stuff now. We need some Paralyzed Heals, first of all. And we could really use some Super Potions. What else do you have? You don't have anything to interest me. Right, let's get some Super Repels, because God knows, when you run into 15,000 of the same crappy Pokemon in a patch of grass, it gets kind of annoying. And some Paralyzed Heals and some Super Potions. Thank you very much. Thank you. Come again. Let's talk to the people in here, shall we? I pick you. I'm having a hard time deciding if I should make my Skitty evolve. I only have to use this Moonstone, but it's so hard to decide. If I make it evolve, it will become much stronger. But it will look so different too. Do it. I want all sorts of things, but I used up my allowance. Wouldn't it be nice if there were a spell that made money appear when you waggle a finger? If you want, I can teach your Pokemon the move Metronome. Okay. Money won't appear, but your Pokemon will waggle a finger. Yes. Yes. We'll see about that. I don't think that's a very good move, is it? This nugget I found here, I suppose I'll have to sell it, seeing as how it has no other use. Ah, that's right, they're just for selling, aren't they? Let's quickly see who can learn Metronome, because unless I'm mistaken, I think anyone can, can't they? Yes, 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 whatever. Oh, apparently not. Just Sableye. Hmm. Did they change that? I could have sworn anyone could learn it in the first generation. I might be imagining that. Uh, let's sell the nugget. Nope, I'm on buy. Sell. There we go. Where's the nugget? Where are you? Good question. Where the hell is the nugget? There we are. 5,000? Holy crap. I'm glad I remembered to do that. Thanks for reminding me, random dude. That was one productive trip to the shop. 
And we can come back and get Metronome if it's good, but I'm pretty sure it's just kind of a crappy move. Something's happening. Oh, we spoke to you. Screw off, buddy. Battle tents. Right, let's check out the battle tent, and then we will leave the town. I'm guessing the enemies are going to be level 30 again. You know how the battle tents offer different events in different towns? My favorite is definitely the battle tent in Falabarara Town. I think it's fantastic how trainers try to win with all their faith in their Pokemon. Do you now? Foo -foo 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 -foo. I'm going to make everyone think I'm just a kid and let them play down. Then I'll shock them and grab the title. Yeah, he's going to be the WWE Champion. But Doctor, talk to me, buddy. I heard something about some tent, so I came to camp out. I didn't know that tents these days are so luxurious. Since I'm here, I may as well try my hand at battling. Scott. Hi, Mr. Anderson. So you came out to this battle tent. The people in these parts tend to be easygoing and laid back. But you see, what I'm looking for are people with... With what, Scott? How should I say this? Some bursting with a desire and drive to win. If there were a trainer like that, I'd immediately... Whoops, never mind. Keep working on it. What are you up to? I don't trust you. I do not trust you, Scott. Okay, uh... You, nah, I feel like we should check out the battle tent. Let's go back and check out the battle tent. What I'm going to do is I'm going to check it out. If all of the enemies are level 30, then we won't do it this video. We'll come back to it because there's no way I'm going to beat them with a bunch of level 25. So I'll be back in a second. Okay, unfortunately they are all level 30. I could probably take them, but it might take a few tries and the rewards are basically nothing. So we will come back when we're level 30 and have a fair fight. All my Pokemon does is roar. No one dares to come near me. So if you would, please take this TM away. Guess and that's the raw TM. Guess what, buddy? I don't really want it. Yeah, it contains raw. Screw you! Oh, I see people. What up, people? Oh, come on, I wanted a double battle. Me? I'm not just a pretty face. Let me evaluate that. Oh god, you're hideous! No, I'm just kidding. Picnic a Charlotte would like to battle, and Charlotte has a nun's leaf. Yo, Kadabra! Except you can't hit him. God damn it. I think the smart move here is to switch in Combuscan and kick him in the face. Fake out. Aha, you suck. Wait, isn't this supposed to make me flinch? I'm... Fake out makes you flinch, right? Why didn't I flinch? I'm okay with that, don't misunderstand me, but uh, I don't understand exactly what happened. But I did just kill you with one double kick and that makes me very happy. Level up. Oh, we defeated Picnic of Charlotte. That wasn't cute in the least. It wasn't meant to be. An arse whooping is never cute. Okay, let's take that damn macho brace off of Combuscan so he's not incredibly slow, and we will switch Sableye into first place because he's the lowest guy we have. What up, Fisherman? I landed a big one. A huge one, I tell you. That's what they all say. Fisherman Kai. And he's got a Barboach. A Captain Barbosa. Honestly, I was kind of expecting the dude to have a magic arp and I was about to flip a table. Okay, let's try Fake Out. This does make them flinch, right? It's not my imagination. Yeah, it does. Why didn't Combuscan flinch? That's weird. Let's try Nightshade. It might be able to finish him off. Come on, kill him. Oh, lame. Well, at least he's easy to kill now. Let's try Rock Smash just for fun. I think this thing is Rock and Water. I'm not sure, but I think he is. Level up. Oh, so close. What was that about? Did mine lose in size? Yes! Yes, yours lost in size. You have a very small one, sir. And we got some energy powder. Yeah, I have no idea what that does. Should probably check it out, but I'm pretty lazy. Anything over here? We might be able to climb that with waterfall, but we don't have that. If we were fishing, you wouldn't stand a chance against me. So bring on your Pokemon. So take your best shot, give it all you got. Come on! Magic up, really? Screw you hard. Screw you really hard. Hey, we leveled up. Fantastic. New move? Ah, oh, Goldeen. Let's stay in. Why the hell not? Come on, Goldeen. Bring it on, dude. I'm pretty sure Goldeen's best move, at least at early levels, is Horn Attack. And that's normal, as I recall. If it is, he won't be able to hit us with that. So that's very useful. And we keep making him flinch. That's even more useful. Let's rock smash him. Yeah, rock smash is going to be our insulting KO move. Well, that's a lot of EXP. He's got another Captain Barbosa. Yar. You be a pirate, says I. 
Captain Barbosa was a freaking badass. He's easily my favourite character in Pirates of the Caribbean. Speaking of which, is anyone looking forward to Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag? I am. I mean, I'm kind of a hypocrite. I, you know, Call of Duty's repetitive as crap, but Assassin's Creed does the same thing, but I buy it every damn year because I'm a hypocritical bastard. If we were fishing, I would have won. Well, it's a good damn job we weren't fishing then, isn't it? Oh, hello. I need to exercise after a meal. Let's have a match. Okay, okay then. It's not really you exercising, though, is it? It's kind of your Pokemon. That's what fat people do. They have other people exercise for them, and then they pretend that they're doing it. Go, Sableye! Tear this Marill to pieces. Fake out. Yeah, I kind of love Fake Out. I kind of love Sableye as well. He's not very powerful, as you can clearly see, but defensively he's just so good because he's not weak to anything and there's a bunch of things that just can't even hit him. Gotta kinda love him. He's awesome. And down you go, buddy. Do you have any more Pokemon? I don't recall. You do, you have a Lombre. Ombre. <laughs> Bring it on, Lombre, you monkey son of a bitch. Let's try Fake Out. The move failed. So I'm guessing since it says it's a first turn, first hit move, you have to use it on your very first hit with Sableye, otherwise it doesn't work. Either way, it's still an awesome move, even if you can only use it once a battle. You can growl all you freaking want, it's not going to affect me. The move failed. Kill him. Oh my god, he's got like one HP, what is this nonsense? Astonish. Damn it, I should have used Rock Smash, I forgot. Whatever, he's dead. Wow, that's a lot of XP. Yes! Level 25. Learn a new move. Ooh, oh, detect. I don't want detect. I despise detect. No. Get it out of my sight. Oh, no! Rot roll, Raggy. Okay, before we check out the house, let's check over here. This is very suspicious. Buried treasure? There is. There be treasure, says I. I knew it. There was no way there was going to be a random pinnacle around here with nothing there. We got a revive out of it. That's genius intuition. Right, so how do we get to the house? Oh, I guess we go down here. I spy some twins. Sneak around the back. Ha ha! Who taught you about Pokemon? Good question. I can't remember who it was. It was Professor... No, I really can't remember. Senior and Junior, Tyra and Ivy. Ooh... And Ivy's got a Rosalia, very clever Nintendo. Poison Ivy, yeah. Okay, we are going to fake out the bush, and then we are going to kick the freaking rock in the mush. Yeah, yeah, what, 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 I'm a rapper now. Holy crap, we just one-shot Rosalia with fake out. That was awesome. Your turn, Combuskin. You failed, Combuskin. You have really, really failed, Combuskin. You've let me down. You dishonor thy family. Mudsport, yeah! Shame we don't have any electricity, and we haven't had so far, I don't think. We probably will eventually, but I find you never really need it unless you have really crappy other elements, but whatever. We'll probably get one eventually. We have defeated Senior and Junior, Tyra and Ivy. What an amazing battle style, I know. I know. This dude over here looks like a triplet of them. What's this? Lynette's house. Ah, she said to come speak to her. I love using the berry crush machine, so I'm collecting berries. I'll share one with you if you'd like. Obtain the rest, Mateus Berry. You should try the berry crush machine with your friends. I, I, I'm using an emulator. Don't tell him. How do we get over here? Is there an exit behind the house? I guess we go see, shall we? No. Oh, Mr. Anderson, I'm sorry, everything is so cluttered when I get engrossed in research. Things end up this way. This is embarrassing, please keep this a secret in exchange for this. Obtain the Lotad doll. Okay, cool. But you said to come see you, what did we come to see you for? May I offer advice about my Pokemon storage system? You should organize your boxes so you can tell which Pokemon are in them. Sure, but why were we supposed to come see you? For a Lotad doll? I am confused. No, I don't want to read the notes. Okay. That was really freaking random. Why did we have to come see her? Like, hey buddy, come see me. And then you go there and she's like, oh, don't tell anyone about this mess. And then she gives you a doll and then you leave. Okay. Camping is fun. You can fish, roast marshmallows and tell spooky stories. But the best of all, 
Now the Pokemon battles. Doodle -doodle -doodle -doodle. Camper Freak would like to battle. Camper Freak is a sand shrew. Go Sableye! Okay, let's try Fake Out. I'm loving this move. Doesn't do much damage. Well, at least not to this guy. Freaking kick the crap out of Rosalia. Let's see if we can finish him off with a, uh, a Nightshade, shall we? Suck it! Come on, finish him off, buddy. I have faith in you. Yeah. Okay, I think he had at least one more. Yes, he has a Nun's Leaf. Mm, let's keep in Sableye, shall we? I know we could just kick the crap out of it with Combuscan, but it's fun to level up Sableye. Let's give him a Rock Smash, shall we? Because he should be weak to it being dark. Racist. Yes, it's super effective. One more. Yes, even his defense fell. Oh, come on. Now he's raising it. He made that completely pointless. Stop making me a liar. Punch him to death. Yes, fantastic. And Nun's Leaf has been defeated. And I believe we have now defeated Camper Shane. Yes, level 26. We've got tons of defense out there, not bad. Way too strong. Whoa, man, dude. Okie dokie, since Sableye is now our highest level, let's switch in our good friend Aaron, because Aaron hasn't had a chance to cause some destruction lately. This time, Aaron, it is time. Your thirst for blood will be quenched. Uff, 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 uff. Want to battle against my Pokemon? Sure, buddy, that's kind of the point of the game. Oh, it's a Pokemaniac, Steve, and he's wearing Charizard legs. And you have an Aaron. That's highly irritating. Aaron, not so good against Aaron. If we had Dig, we might be, but we don't. Roll out. Oh, come on, Aaron. Why do you always miss? Nobody misses as much as you. Nothing compares to you. Thank you. Yeah, didn't do very much at all. My hope is that because Rollout gets more powerful over time, that, you know, it will eventually actually do something, because I don't want to switch him out. We've only just put the damn fool in. Come on, Aaron. We are behind you 100%. You can do this, buddy. You can freaking do this. Just get a crit or something. If I had some pom-poms, I would be waving them right now. Come on, Aaron. Go, Aaron. Go, Aaron. Yes, that's right. Come on. Crit him. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Screw you. <laughs> God damn it. Metal Claw. It's not going to do much at all. Oh, it did 8 damage. That's not bad, I guess. Yes. Aaron has been defeated by Aaron. Aaron wins. Flawless victory. Well, not really. My Pokemon. Oh, no. Don't forget what you've done to me. I'll make it so you can't forget. Registered Pokemaniac Steve and our Pokey freaking Nav. Huh? The item finder's responding? Yes, it's got to be on that rock. I knew he was protecting something. Carlos, you sneaky peep. You cannot hide your treasure from me, buddy. I'm the world's greatest thief. What do we got here? Oh, Lotat. Get out of my sight. I didn't want you at the start of the game, and I certainly don't want you now. Let's see if we can find anything interesting in the tall grass very quickly. I'm not going to do this for long. A lombre. Do we want to catch a lombre? It is a monkey wearing a hat, but no, I think we will resist the urge. Let's quickly try one more time. Lotat, okay. Boy. Right, let's continue. Rock smash. Go Sableye. Aha. Protein. Oh, the bag's full. Oh, crap. Okay, let's get rid of some stuff. We may as well use up the uh, ones we have. Carbos raises speed. Let's give that to Combuscan. And then we will... What else do we have here that we can get rid of? Let's give the HP up to, I guess, Combuscan as well. Yes, I know. I'm going to use most of it on Combuskin. He is one of our main guys. We'll get rid of the X speed because I just don't even want it. Get out of my sight. Get out of my sight. Oh, okay. Have to press the other button. Uh, we don't want you either. Normally I'd cut this out, but people will wonder where these things have gone, so I'm just going to leave it in. And we'll give the PP up to... We want to use it on a move we're going to keep. So, let's use it on Recover because we're not going to get rid of that. Fantastic. Okay, I think we've pretty much emptied the inventory now. Let's grab our protein. Yummy! Okay, let's use it immediately before I forget. Okay, it raises attack. Let's give that to Combuscan as well, I suppose. I know someone's going to shout at me for giving them all to Combuscan, but it's hard to explain, but these things are really not that important. All they do is give you boosts that you can get by just leveling up and battling, so by the time we get to late game, it won't matter, because 
everyone will have these stat boosters anyway, because they just come naturally. It's just that giving them protein and carbos and crap just makes it quicker. And there is a hell of a lot of places around here to make a base, and apparently no secrets, and that makes me a very sad panda. If you're lighting a campfire, make sure you have water handy. Well, that's, that's good information. That is good freaking information. Also, don't run with scissors and don't play with fireworks. Be safe, kids. Be safe. Go, Aaron! We are going to be weak to this dude, but you know what? I switched him in. We're going to use him. That's the stuff right there. I knew you wouldn't let me down. Again. And conveniently, the poor sap has a wing goal. And we have rollout. So... This should be a piece of cake. I don't know why a piece of cake means easy, but it does. Aha, you missed. Roll out. R -r -r Roll out. It's super effective. And you have been defeated, Wingo. And that is the end of Kindler Bernie. Wait a minute, Bernie. Burn. Fire. That's genius. <laughs> you set my spear on fire, let's register each other. And we have Kindler Bernie in our Pokenev. Wow, Nintendo, wow. You get me every damn time. Oh, come on, there's got to be some secrets around here. There's tons of rocks. Double battle. If you're not prepared, you shouldn't be up in the mountains. Have you made your Pokemon evolve very much? Very much. Jimmy. Timmy. I'm looking at her. Heike Lucas and Picnica Angelina Jolie. Geodude and Lombre. Well, we have the perfect solution for you, don't we? We are going to kick the Geodude in the freaking face, and we're going to take down the Lombre. Suck it, Lombre. Yeah, Geodude is no match. It's super effective. And down you go. Your turn, Lombre. Wow, what crappy XP. Wow, they have four Pokemon? Okay. Noble, who looks dopey as crap. Take down. Die, scum. Oh, come on. Nature power, man. Gotta protect the forest, man. It's not very effective, but it's annoying. I'm gonna take down you, and we are going to, I guess, kick the Numal, because we can't really use anything else to great effect. That that worked. Yeah, that did the trick. One freaking kick, and your crappy Numal has been defeated. Also bad EXP. And down you go, Lombre. So you have one more, I believe. What you got, buddy? Yeah, level 26 on Combuskin. Oh, no new move. Come on, learn a new move, goddamn you. Maril. Well, this should be elementary, my dear Watson. Take down and double kick. Goodbye, Maril. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You have been the one. You have been the one for me. That's even worse, EXP. Yeah, the mountains are unforgiving. Oh, I see, that's good to know. <laughs> I bet. No, no phone numbers? Screw you, people. Wow, another base. What the hell? And there's no secrets. Why? Give me secrets. Oh, a cave. The Cave of Wonders and Mystery. Yoda lay here. You're supposed to shout, I did. Since it doesn't echo here. I did, buddy, I did it. I mean, I didn't really shout because my neighbors would think I'm absolutely batshit insane, even though they probably already do. Hiker Lenny. No! Not Lenny! Go, Aaron! We have the perfect move for you. Except I've gone temporarily blind. There we go. Holy crap. I couldn't see that for a second. I don't know why. Yeah, it's super effective. We might get a level from this. Then again, Geodude isn't particularly good at XP. Nope, we got a level. Fantastic. Get a new move. Oh, come on. Ma Chop. Okay, let's put in Kadabra. I'm tempted to put in Sableye, but he has had tons of EXP today, so we'll give Kadabra a whirl. Punch, kick, block. Turn and kick it. Turn and pose. Parappa the Rapper, people. Vintage game. Vintage. It's super effective, and you have been slain mercilessly. 169, yeah. Yoda lay he freaking who? Number? Ah, oh, I want the Yodaless number. Secrets? Come on, there's got to be freaking secrets around here. This sucks, there's no secrets. Destroy this just in case. No, nope, there's jack shit around here, apparently. Well, Meteor Falls. Next time, we head through Meteor Falls, the Cave of Darkness and Wonders. And yes, I know every single cave is the Cave of Darkness and Wonders, but that's besides the point. Anyhow, if you enjoyed the video, I always appreciate a like, and I'll see you guys next time for more Pokemon Emerald.